Good afternoon, my foodie family. How's everybody doing this afternoon? I'm just going to do a quick video on making a stir fry kit. So, in less than 30 minutes, you'll have dinner ready. And I do not know how to pronounce it, so I'm going to say General TSO, General So. Either way, this little package comes with the broccoli, the Brussels sprouts, red cabbage, kale, carrots, and peas. But I also want more to it, so I chopped up some zucchini here's some fell here in the sun some mushrooms some onions some green red orange and yellow bell pepper so all this is going to be thrown in here you don't have to add any of that but that's what i prefer and i'm going to throw the carrots in there I'm doing it by hand because I don't want the pack to fall in there. There's broccoli in here. I love broccoli. There's the pack. That's what I was looking for. Anyways, it's just an easy meal. I didn't feel like cooking today, so I went and bought a rotisserie chicken and on that I shredded the rotisserie ah shredded the chicken right here. So that's what I'm going to put in here. I might not put all of it, not sure yet, depending on this right here. And I'm going to cut up a little bit of the green onions, some of this right here, so I can pour some at the end. And I'm just going to go ahead and cook it until I like um, my carrots very tender. So that's what I'm going to do. And then instead of making rice, I went ahead and bought. Uh, Uncle Ben's whole grain brown rice and it's 90 seconds. I love using these So it's uh, real easy. I don't have to worry about it mm -hmm. Having to be on the stove here for a long time Let me give this a quick stir here And I just put a little bit of oil But I'm gonna add a little bit of uh, sesame oil at the end when I finish um, cooking let me get it out real quick. Okay, Annalena, I'll wait for you. <laughs> but this is what I'll put at the end to give it some added flavor. Uh, you could put more soy sauce if you want because the rice doesn't have any flavor at all. And this is just something real simple. Especially like us, we love Chinese food. I can eat this every day. So I'm just cutting up some green onions, like I said. I'm going to use them. When I put the um, sesame oil, I'll add the green onions to it to give it a little bit more added flavor. Originally, I was just going to make plain chicken. And I was going to um, make lettuce wraps. But I decided... Since I already have the little kit here, I might as well use it instead of buying all the extra stuff I needed to make just the chicken by itself. So I might as well just use this little kit I have here. Um, I started buying these because it has a lot of vegetables. And of course I add more vegetables to it. I don't. And then I put the chicken so it's not high in calories because you're getting full with all the vegetables and stuff. So I like that. So I'm able to eat a little bit more, but without the added calories. Of course, there is calories, you know, but not a lot compared to where you go out and eat and you get all of those extra calories. So at least this way you can control what you're putting in into it. And you don't have to worry you know, what, what are they putting in there. But it has a little bit of snow peas. These are my favorite. Those and um, watercress. But I didn't buy any watercress. I forgot about them. Either way, my husband doesn't like them, so. Uh, I don't like um, when we get um, Chinese food that they put the little baby corn. I don't like those. So I won't eat them. But anyways, it's real simple. You can have all this done within 30 minutes, especially if you don't want to be in the kitchen for that long. These are super easy to make. I, like I said, I didn't feel like being in the kitchen, so 
this is what I'm going to do. And it comes with a little so a little packet, little sauce that comes in the in the container, the little package. And um, it's already pre-seasoned basically for you. But I will add a little bit of garlic to this to give it some flavor once I add the chicken. And um, I like my vegetables soft and tender. I, uh, my husband likes it more with a bite. But that's what I prefer. Yeah. Especially the carrots. I, I like my carrots tender. And I like having my zucchini tender and my mushrooms, I like them toasty. And I like my broccoli tender, so most likely this will overcook. And I don't want to wash dishes either, so I'm going to use paper plates today, or foam plates. That's where I'm going to serve it on. Put a little bit of rice on there. But, okay, so. And all I'm going to use is just, uh, see, I like measuring mine so I can count my calories. So mine is going to be a half a cup of rice. So I pre-measure everything for myself. But I'm just plating that one. Later on, I'll measure everything else. Okay. So this is all to this. I'm going to add some chicken now. And add a little bit of garlic as well. Just give it a little bit more flavor. Like I said, I bought a just plain uh, rotisserie chicken. And I shredded it. My plans were to make um, lettuce wraps to begin with. Um, let's see here. Now I don't want to put too much chicken because I prefer just the vegetable. If anybody else wants more chicken, they can add some to their plate. Just mix it real good. Make sure that garlic gets everywhere and it doesn't just get stuck in one area. Okay, and then to that, I'm going to add the sauce. And all you do is mix it until that sauce is uh, mixed through all of it. That smells good. You want it to warm up. If it is cold, it's in the refrigerator. Okay, that smells really good. And just a few drops of the sesame oil, or you know, a little bit more than a few drops, since I am making quite a bit. And then to that, the really chopped up green onions, give it some more added flavor, but they won't be well tipped like the rest of the um, vegetables. And that is it. We're done. It's a few minutes and we have dinner ready. I think it took me like maybe five minutes to shred the chicken. And that was it. Done. It smells really good. Ouch! Burn myself. Okay. Now half a cup of everything. Let me take it off the heat so you can stop cooking here. I'm gonna take it out of the pot here in a little bit. But half a cup of rice and half a cup of that vegetables and stuff. That's that's a lot of food right there. And I'll give you all the calories later on today and how much it is for that. But it's real tasty and everything. So y'all have a good day. Go ahead and start posting what y'all are going to eat later today. Bye.